Okay, so another Zondervan study Bible reading. We still have a few more pages before the... Yeah, before we get to the actual just straight up scripture. Man, yeah, there are study notes on study notes, man. The last bit in this introduction page here. It's talking about um, cross references. And I, I don't know how to describe it because I don't really have the time right now to fully edit um, these things. We will in the future. But for now, just a description. There's like, I've seen this in multiple Bibles too. Or I guess just smaller study Bibles because I just thought they were regular Bibles. Um, in between the text, if you're looking at like the scriptures, like Genesis, you know, like that. In between, there's like this column and all these tiny like other scripture chapters and verses in there. I take it those are the cross references they're referring to. I never understood what those were for before. So that's just interesting to know if you know what I'm talking about. That's kind of why too I started posting so much or a part of why aside from just literal gain from it. I really want to get down to the nitty gritty of like everything from books to the historical context of what's been happening in all these nations to animated media. I really want to just like understand everything I've taken in or some people say overstand like really just get on top of like what have I even consumed physically, mentally, and spiritually throughout the last as long as I've been born to now like I don't know if I said that right but you get the gist um, just in my life what have I really taken in what are the rules and boundaries that it even exists within how can I apply that to my own life, et cetera, et cetera. Like even too, just reading, um, there's all these different things. Like these things have credits, they have starting credits, middle cre end credits, all this other like stuff for legalities that can be uh, really critical just in general. But um, even too, if you want to step into production of anything like in that arena like y'all see that pink sauce thing like stuff like that just really knowing what you're getting into and the necessary work and protections um, that would be wise to study within it Let's see, we're still on the introduction, but next page. So they're just talking about marginal notes. Oh wait, so is that what those middle things? Because they're talking about superior notes, superior references, marginal notes and references. Superior letters refer to cross references. Like what? That's why I kind of can't wait to write my thoughts once I get some more time beforehand instead of just kind of freestyling these book readings because there's a lot of language I just do not understand or understand. So then it has 
with some concordance. I've never heard that word before, concordance. But it's designed as a quick reference tool to enhance Bible study to look up key words. This has 59 maps, 30, 13 full color, 46 black and white. The full color maps at the end of this Bible covered nearly 4,000 years of history from the patriarchs to Christianity in the world today. Oh yeah, they got maps at the end too and had maps at the start. More. I don't even know. I've never seen these land masses, though, from the sky, space, all of that. I'm like, how do I even know this is real? Or how real is it? More or less? And they say that they've strategically placed maps throughout the text, almost four dozen black and white maps throughout it. And the map page contains a complete list of the topics covered. This allows Bible students to visualize David's city and the places through which Paul traveled on his missionary journeys. Hmm. Oh, they got different colored text in here, too. I ain't never seen a Bible with that. Or I've never seen a Bible with that, I should say. Yeah, I'll just cut it off here for now. So, I'm going to just pray out the Most High. Thank you for another day, another second, every future second, every previous second. This life, the state that was before, then the state and self that will be after. Excuse me. Alongside all the previous states, present state and states and future states that have been allotted to my soul tribe and bloodline, please continue to guide us through these trying times. Give us the strength when tried to react accordingly and with your will in mind. Please continue to break these generational curses on my bloodline and soul tribe and, and for and please continue to, to break the generational curses of anyone willing to call out to you and do right by you and your will. Hmm. Thank you for the mercy, the forgiveness. For the numerous times I can recall and can recognize such. And for the times I can't recall, uh, please bring those forgotten sins to the forefront of my mind so I may atone properly and, and work on that and serve you better um, 
please continue to send all the guardian, battle, healing, ministering angels that you can around myself, my bloodline, my soul tribe, anyone. Calling out to you and willing to do right by you. And willing to do right by you. Did I repeat that? I don't know. In your offspring's name I pray. For I am unclean, especially in your light, and appreciate any vouching on my behalf, any repetition, relaying of my will to you, the Most High. Above all else, uh, to you be the glory, Most High, the Most High. I just want the spoils and the knowledge, wisdom, and discernment to not be spoiled by them. So above all else, let your will as it is in heaven be done here on earth and all of creation. Amen. So yeah, links to ways to support me and the channel in the description below. Cash app, all of that. Patreon on the way. Links to the social media as well. Adding stuff to that as well in the description. I'm about peace out. Bye.